What is up guys, Chelsea from Min Industries FI Garage and we are here with none other than the Adhan DS01. Now this has been a requested wheel that we've gone over for quite some time and today we're gonna take a little bit of a deeper look into it and kind of go over it, what sizes are offered in, and just kind of give you our thoughts about it. Now we've gone over Adhan wheels in the past, but have never taken the time to go in depth into any of their like individual wheels, besides from like unboxing them. So getting right into it, one thing to note about Adhan as a company is that they have a few different lineups as far as their wheels go. The AH line, which is more of like a classic JDM styling wheel line. The LS, which is more designed for like bigger cars, like VIP, muscle cars, things like that and then their AFF line which is they only have one wheel in it currently but they're working on it it's the start of Adhan's flow form lineup and then we have the DS line which is arguably probably one of their most popular lines that Adhan offers now the DS series wheels are meant to cater to more of the stance scene whether it be from slam civics to WRX's to even wide body BRZ's and FRS's now the DS01 is a very popular wheel for that reason, but also quite a few other reasons as well. Number one is the actual design of the wheel. With the DS01, you get a cool twisted design that also gives you that simulated multi-piece look. We see that with the step lip here, as well as the gold hardware that goes around the face of the wheel. One important thing to note as we're talking about the face here is that because they are a single piece cast wheel, they're not a true multi-piece wheel, is that they have a twisted design to the face is that they're not a fully directional wheel. Now what I mean by that is that if you pick up a set of these wheels and you go ahead and you and you place them out in front of you one by one by one by one, is that they're all gonna look exactly the same, meaning that if you're looking down at them, they're all gonna twist the same way. So what happens is when you throw them on your car, because there's no left side or right side to the wheels, is that one side of the car is gonna have them what we call swooping or the twist pointing towards the rear end of the car, while the other side is going to be digging, where the points are gonna be kind of swooping towards the front of the car. Now, if that's something that doesn't bother you at all, that's obviously not an issue, just something to keep in mind with these DSO-1s. As far as the finish goes on these guys, is probably another key factor into why these are so popular. So obviously, if you look at this one here, it is a very high gloss, chrome finish now this is what they consider their vacuum chrome finish it's very very reflective you got the gold hardware here so very flashy very shiny <laughs> styling to this wheel now they also have other finishes offered with these as well if you're not looking for something this bright they have the bronze face with machine lip silver with a machine lip gloss black vacuum black and even a vacuum gold now the gloss finishes won't be as reflective or shiny as the vacuum finishes like the vacuum gold vacuum silver and vacuum black if you want something that's a little more dull not as crazy those gloss finishes are going to be what you're going to want to look at a couple other features on the ds01 is that they can be offered in a pretty decent size hence the reason why they're in their own ds lineup with that kind of cater toward more of the stance. So this one that we have here, the DSO one is actually an 18 by 10 and a half. Now they offer these from 18 and 19 inches in diameter and have widths ranging from eight and a half all the way up to what we have here, the 10 and a half inch wide. Now with offsets ranging from plus 35 all the way down to plus 15, you can achieve a pretty aggressive stance with these wheels. And then of course, the last reason why these wheels are so popular is due to their price. Now the DSO one can be considered an entry level wheel of sorts due to the price of them. For right around $940, you can get into a set of DSO ones in an 18 by nine and a half plus 35 with this exact finish. That being said, if you're interested in finding out more about these wheels specifically or any other models that Adhan offers, you can check them out over at our website at www.fitmentindustries.com. Pair them with some tires, save some money, and get them mounted, balanced, and shipped to your door for free in the lower 48. And of course, the final plug of today, if you're curious about what the wheel fitment on your specific car is, you can always check out the fitment in our gallery. It's an insanely useful tool. Plug in your exact year, make, and model. We'll show you not only what's wheel sizes, but what tire sizes fit as well. See if there's any trimming you have to do, what kind of suspension people are running, and you'll see that exact setup on people's cars. But that's gonna do it for today. I'm Jealous from Fitment Industries. This is the Adhan DS01. We will see you later. Peace.